Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to present to you the release notes of Boeing MIT's Pales Manufacturing 2023.04. In this version, we are introducing our new product design called Boeing New Style Beta. This is the first beta version to feature this new design. Our changes impact the overall design of the program in aesthetics, readability, usage of efficiency, and provide a streamlined minimalistic look and feel. Let's see all these in detail. We offer this enhancement as a style that the user can select at any time. If you wish to keep the old design, it is always selectable in the Administration menu, View Setting Group. Just open the Design drop-down menu and select any of the SAP type themes or the brand new poem style beta. To activate the new theme in SAP, just enable the Activate Style inside SAP checkbox. We're introducing new stock Boyum colors that support our branding. We are launching a brand new set of optimized, modernized icons with flat design and enhanced usability in all types of BAS forms. Let's take a look at the most important features. To align BAS with other Boyum products, we decided to break with the traditional outdated design that is also detectable in SAP Business One. All BAS icons were redesigned, unifying the color and ensuring the quality and clear visibility. The new BAS icons not only align the color, but also aim to reflect the real meaning to make it easier to understand what the user is perceiving. When conceiving the new look and feel, we applied the colors of the Boehm Style Guide, following the design that will be applied to other Boehm products as well. This ensures uniform branding for all. As our users tend to set various screen resolutions, we improve the font size to make the information easier to read in any setting. The right-click menu also represents the new set of icons. The search icon has been replaced with the magnifying glass image, and the template and customizations menus in the bottom right corner of the screens have also changed. As BEL screens allow user customization as well as support multiple languages, Tooltips have been included in the columns. In this respect, when the content cannot be fully displayed, the user can read it by hovering the mouse over the column. Also, tooltips have been added for strategic icons, for example, to explain additional information in the work order screen. The default yellow arrows presented in SAP were removed and converted into links, cleaning up the listing information and making it clearer and more intuitive. We also added links to the listing numbers, making it easier to open the editing window from that line with just one click, which up to now was performed with a double click or with the open button. Apart from removing the yellow arrows from the lists, we also cleaned up the colors to help the user focus on the most relevant information and easily detect the statuses presented in the BAS screens, such as delays or problems in an order. The desktop terminal I used on the shop floor has also received a facelift. New icons and colors appear with a new look and feel. The login screen has been improved to display clear information on the login status placed in a central field. Since the size of fields and the space between window elements has increased, we relocated certain fields in some BAS windows. This also affects users of other themes. Please review your window field customizations in BAS windows upon your first trial of the new style, as fields may be in different positions. Here you can find a list of windows that have the position of certain fields changed. This concludes the summary of our beta user interface changes introduced with BAS Manufacturing 2023.04. Download this latest upgrade and try the new design and get back to us concerning any questions you might have. According to our release roadmap, our next version will be 2023.06 to be released at the end of June 2023. Thank you very much for your attention.